And as you can see right here, our automation has successfully run. And if you notice the response, so all success, it's all green tick. And if you go to our stories, let's refresh this. Okay, that is our uh, new article. And if you open that, look at that. It has the featured image, okay, directly from active pieces. He already composed a high quality, you know, SEO friendly structure article with the right number of words. Very easy using active pieces and using this uh, circuit AI automation helper. So. Hello guys, I just want to show you and share with you this uh, tactic that you need to use in order for you to auto post directly to your Medium account using Active Pieces. As you notice in Active Pieces, it's uh, not like, you know, make.com that when you add a module right here and you uh, search Medium, it's not coming up. And, you know, uh, posting to Medium, it's uh, a lot of technical process if you need to manually do that using HTTPS service. So what I uh, did here, uh, and you can use this guys for free, you can use this service Circuit AI Automation Helper, okay? So when you go to home page, you will see right here, this is a medium automation helper. You can even use this to simplify your workflow even in make.com. But if you're using active pieces, because you know active pieces, price is affordable one dollar you just need to pay one dollar and you need to you can have another one thousand task okay you don't need to have a monthly subscription of uh like twelve dollars or fifteen dollars to get additional tasks active pieces what's uh, good about this is very flexible so we can just only pay one dollar and we can always have one thousand extra uh you know uh, tasks uh on top of the free 1000 tasks per month. So what you just need to do here, when you want to auto post to your medium, you just follow this simple instruction right here. So you just head over to the site, HTTPS circuitai.online. Then just register your account very quickly. As you can see, I registered the account. And here you just need to follow this instruction. So what you need to do here in your active pieces. So if you are going to create an article, so first, our first step is of course, we will be using the usual tactic here, uh, the usual for template that we're using to in spreadsheet to get keywords right here and in your active pieces just search that okay the status equals to pending okay so we will capture the first keyword and then here we will uh, generate an article okay based on the keyword okay so here you just select the uh, values of the keyword right here in column A okay so uh, I'm just using the service of Article AI Generator just to make this process uh, really quick. So you just need to follow the instruction here in Article AI Generator. Go to App Secret Key and you can find these instructions right here to create a HTTP request and, you know, generate your high quality article, which I will show you later. But it's optional to use this. You can create an article from OpenAI. Okay, I'm, I'm going to show you uh, maybe in the next video. So this video won't be too long because we want to focus on, you know, posting automatically to our Medium account using this simple service. Again, as you can see, the fourth uh, step right here, we will need to post to our Medium account. And as I mentioned earlier, if you search Medium, it won't be there. So what you need to do to post to Medium, uh, search this HTTP and make this send request. Okay, make the method post Go to this uh, circuit AI automation tool helper. So you can see here, medium automation helper. You just need to copy the request URL right here, paste that right there. And you follow the header parameters, get the content type, copy the content type and paste that in the key. Very simple. And this one right here. Okay, that's so simple. So I made it simple for you guys. And you can leave the query params blank or you can put also here, but uh, yeah, to be sure, post it right here in the body type form data. So pass this mandatory parameters. So username, so copy this username. Okay, so your username will be right here. Copy that. And then again, the second parameter will be the identifier. So the identifier is the credential where you want to post because here you can, you know, add, if you have multiple Medium account or WordPress account, you can add it here. So you add your Medium account. So make a connection name, for example, my Medium account right here. So here, go to security apps. And here in the integration token, copy this integration token, copy it like that. And here, make, name your medium account first, for example, uh, name this one. And then my token right here, okay? And then add your uh, credentials. So as you can see, add it successfully. You click this credential, so to view all, this is your ident identifier. So you copy that and go to active pieces. So this one is identifier and paste that right here. Now the second, the third parameter, go back to home. The third parameter will be the post title, okay, which will be coming from the generated information that, for example, in Article AI Generator. So you click that 
Okay, take this uh, HTTP from the step three, of course, body, and then the title, the title of your article, okay? Title right there, and here, the next para uh, parameter will be this one, the post content, all right? Take that and then select the content, okay? Just like that, and that's it, it's done. You're now able to run this automation. Just add your fifth step, which is, uh, you know, uh, Google Sheet to mark the uh, keyword here, as done okay so that the automation will be capturing the second keyword right here so we'll do that we will select update uh, role and google sheet and then select your google sheet right here and then of course the sheet name row number will be uh, dynamic which coming from here the response from this second step okay and then uh here we will have the uh just take this so that it will uh have the column name right here okay this column name which is status as you can see just mark it to done that's it that's our fifth step now when we run this automation this one will auto post that to our medium account so okay so make sure the identifier is correct right here let's check the credentials this is the identifier of you can add multiple medium account and wordpress account right here you can copy the identifier just like that and uh, make sure it's correct and your username must be correct as well and then the post title and then that's it now, let's run this workflow. It should be in our medium now. And as you can see right here, our automation has successfully run. And if you notice the response, so all success, it's all green tick. Now, let's take a look at our medium post right here. So our article has been, our, our keyword has been markers done. Let's go to our medium stories. And there you go. That's our medium uh, post right there. And if you take a look, so this is how, how it looks like. We already composed a high quality, you know, SEO friendly structure article with the right number of words, just like that. Very easy using active pieces and using this uh, circuit AI automation helper. So you just need to come to this website and fo easily follow this step right here. You can also do that for your WordPress to simplify your automation right here. So all the steps are very simple. We will be adding more uh, automation helper here to make you keep using uh, active pieces. Well, actually this one, uh, this automation helper uh, service, you can also do that in make that come to make your, uh, you know, automation simple. So you don't need to add multiple parameter, multiple module right here. And uh, right here, you can also add image, okay? You can also upload image directly uh, by just adding this parameter right here. As you can see, you just copy that and come back here to your fourth step. You add that in the form data, add image, you say yes, okay? And then here, that image URL, which is like this. So let's do that, the image URL like this. And the URL must be coming from, uh, you know, the article AI generator, or if you have the URL from any generator you are, you are using. So in here, you just need to add the generate image, generate image, equals to yes just like that okay just like that and of course you have to update the value of this uh image url right here but let me just retest this so that it will produce the image okay so let's retest this so as you can see i resubmitted that this so that i will get uh you know the new data with the image url okay because we will need that if we want to have the value of the image URL directly to our uh, medium post. So image URL, again, we go to the third, this one, let's find the body, uh, let's find this value of the image URL, just like that, okay? The image URL is now set. Now, when we run this automation again, our next post should have an image. So let's do this, let's test the flow. All right, as you can see, our automation has successfully been completed and it took the second keyword right here and mark it as done. And if you go to our stories, let's refresh this, Okay, that is our uh, new article. And if you open that, look at that. It has the featured image, okay, directly from active pieces using this automation helper. Okay, that's simple. Now you can continue using this active pieces every time you need to post to your Medium account as long as you use this uh, AI automation helper just like this. The link will be in the description below. Okay, so very easy. So if you have any question of it or if you need any suggestion, what automation helper you want in order for you to continue using active pieces, uh, just let me know in the comment down below or you can email this support right here.
All right. And I will do more video. Maybe uh, in the next video, I will uh, show you the WordPress automation helper. And we will be also adding Reddit automation helper. So you can easily post Reddit without, uh, you know, doing so much steps here using active pieces. Okay. Uh, by the way, before I forget, if you want to post, uh, if you want the post status to be directly published, so I get, because at the moment, I, uh, I left the post status as blank, but if you want that to be published directly, you make sure you add this post status and then you just mention publish just like that. Okay. So I hope you learned something from this one. And if you do, uh, hit the like button. Thank you.